here's another I've seen on TV product, and this is a swivel store. I got this for my birthday gift. I just had a birthday party in August, and I got this for my birthday gift, and it's supposed to make it, you know, more organized in your pantry or your spice area or whatever. I'm showing it to you this way, first of all, to show you that, you know, like my, my ground cinnamon, I have it in this size. I have my Ricardo, my Belize Ricardo. As you guys know, I have that cooking show. I was trying to drive you guys over there, right? See, I can't fit it in here, so it's not going to work with these spices. I suppose it'll work with this. So anything that comes like that, it'll work with that. And it maybe even work with this one. Yeah, it works so. This, the bigger ones can't work. So that's the first thing that I noticed. So let me show you here. I put all my extracts, because I don't tend to have a lot of spices, because I don't cook with a lot of spices. But I have all my extracts in the thing, and it'll hold quite a bit, because I have trouble storing my extracts in the pantry. Thank you, camera lady, for fixing that for me. So anyways, it's you're supposed to stand it up like this so it's not like the round spice racks that they used to have of yesteryear and then you can slide it out imagine this was in the pantry you slide it out and you can actually swivel it so you can actually see what you want and then turn it back and send it back to where it was so we can also do this one both of them swivel okay so that's pretty awesome at first glance it feels kind of flimsy the plastic that it's made with is kind of flimsy but you have to be gentle with it, right? So let's go to the pantry and see how it'll work. So this is the first thing I noticed. It's too tall. It can't fit here, it can't fit there, and I've tried it where I keep my cups and glasses and it can't fit there either. So it's not gonna serve a purpose if I can't put it in here. So this is the, the cabinet that I keep all my spices, my salt, pepper stuff, extracts, and so on and so on. So I'm gonna have to move it over to the actual pantry. So let's go over there. Okay, so here it is. This is my actual pantry. Now, I won't be able to put it here because if I put it here, I won't be able to pull it out so so well. It might be. It's right at the edge. So just I can't get it behind this lip right here, okay? So let's put it here for this review purpose. And so it would have to pretty much sit there and take up that space in the pantry. And then when I want any of the ingredients, I could pull it out and swivel it. So I'm going to have to leave room to swivel it. So I'm not sure how much that, that how well that idea would work for swiveling. And here's my extracts. And that's what I would have to do. So I would have to keep this like right at the foreground here and keep a lot of stuff away from it. I don't know that it will serve the purpose. I'll use it because it was a gift given to me by my there. The people I met through YouTube, I invited them to my birthday party and they thought highly enough of me to buy this. And so I wanted to review it because I really like the way this is displayed. I just don't like how much space it's going to have to actually take up. But I'm going to make it work because I'm not the kind of person that re-gift gifts at all. And I love when people think enough of me to buy things that they think would make my life a little bit better. So I'm, in, I'm gonna end up putting it here. Okay, I have it off the edge though. And just do it like that. Let's see. I have to pull it all the way. I have to kind of play with it. Yeah, this is gonna be a hard thing to do to put it right there. I'm gonna have to leave it in the middle. So that's my review of the swivel store. Um, it, it doesn't really serve a practical use as you would think. But I'm keeping it because it was a gift. Thanks for watching, you guys.